Thursday's 17th season premiere of Bravo's revived and remodeled Project Runway probably drew its share of curious fans wanting to know how the fashion competition might fare without its twin pillars of taste and discretion, Tim Gunn and Heidi Klum. But based on our poll as well as online comments, many are vowing to make like former host Klum and say, Auf Wiedersehen. The reason? The way they pitted the designers who ended up in the bottom two, Kevin Agbaker, left in photo, and Frankie Lewis, right. Kevin Egg got the entitled, rhymes with itch, edit, while Frankie was portrayed as sweetheart overcoming adversity. All you need to know is that when the designers learned they had $250 to spend at mood, Kevin Ag poo pooed the amount while Frankie was ecstatic about that much cash. They did have commonalities between them, mostly on the negative side. They each had plus-size models, something Lewis said she was familiar with, and they shared trouble picking out their fabric. They both underestimated the amount of they would need for their outfits. And they both had the nerve to solicit sewing help Frankie relying on the kindness of her fellow competitors while Kevin Ag relied on her model to help her stitch something by hand. Discuss, Project Runway, and more in our infamous forums in the end, Frankie's skimpy so-called bodysuit could barely contain her curvy model while Kevin Ag made a rather simple dress that at least covered her model and wasn't unraveling. But they chose to banish Kevin Ag, despite her clearly having more skills at her disposal. The poll tells the story, 35% of the respondents said Kevin Egg's dress was basic but at least it didn't fall apart. Another 23% agreed that Frankie is a nicer person, but she doesn't have what it takes to succeed on Project Runway. Those who were pro-Frankie thought she deserved a second chance and that Kevin Egg was insufferable. And 22% thought Kevin Egg cared less competing on Project Runway than she did about having to subject herself to sleeping in a single. Here is hoping Frankie's flaws were just a fluke and she can get her act together by next Thursday. Meanwhile, here are some reader comments. Jacqueline D. The choice to keep Frankie instead of Kevin Egg was a joke. They lost this viewer. I'll wait for the Heidi. Have watched every season and I can't think of anything that bad that survived. Clearly, she should have been sent home. Kevin Egg's design may have been something of a simplicity to our ish project, but it was flattering to her model. I don't think the judging was true to the spirit of the show and I really hope personality and background don't carry weight in their decisions, Richard Moffat, ditto 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 to Cindy's astute succinct observations. Except to say I will not be wasting my time watching another runway show. Quite obviously these judges cannot be trusted, Donnie Hagee, one show in and this panel of goons have already shown they have no taste in fashion. They sent Kavanaugh home and let Frankie stay. At least Kavanaugh's clothes covered her model's ass. It took six people to finish that thing, Frankie called a garment. First excuse for clothing I've ever seen. It did not look finished, attractive, or flattering. Someone should ask the judges how Frankie's model felt with her very unflattering derriere hanging out. Pitiful. Jackie, you could tell how her model felt by the way she walked down the runway. Charles Shaw, totally destroyed the show. No talent, politically correct, and hideous decision at the end to keep Frankie. Loved the show for 16 seasons but we're done with this mess of a show. Tragic. Sign up for Gold Derby's free newsletter with latest predictions. There were a few dissenting opinions, however, Jane, Kavanagh was all snoot and no authentic talent. Mean girl through and through. I am glad Frankie will return. I don't know how long I would have continued with the show otherwise, Stefananorama, Kavanaugh could have added some drama, but I'm all for the underdog and I'm glad Frankie stayed. I would have got tired very quick of Kavanaugh's entitlement. Deal with that at work and in the everyday I don't need it on the show I was for entertainment. No favorites yet, and already missing Heidi.